An Army veteran says she's disappointed after she was found guilty of an attack by a dangerous dog months after her emotional support dog bit and injured a Colleen mailman. Channel 6 News reporter Jasmine Caldwell was there for the trial and has more on what happened in the courtroom. Jasmine. Well, Doug, prosecutors say the mailman isn't the only person the dog attacked. Now, Army veteran Monique Fishman says her service dog is harmless, but prosecutors Prosecutors say that's not the case and that the dog attacked two people in nine days. Now, back in January, a clean mailman was bit twice on the arm and on the foot when he tried to deliver a package to Fishman's door. Now, once animal control went to the home to serve a seizure warrant, the pit bull named King was became aggressive and nearly attacked the animal control supervisor. Now, King had to be tased by a clean police officer and another animal control officer got the dog in their van. The judge says that Fishman has a few days to appeal. I'm kind of in shock because of the decision uh, by the court right now and the jury. And so we're talking about what, whether we're going to appeal it. We don't know. Uh, we have a few days, to, five days to decide on a motion for a new trial and 10 days for an appeal. So we, we're just not sure. We're, we're just trying to catch our breath right now. Now, Fishman says she suffers from PTSD and depression, and that's why she needs the dog. But it was ordered by the judge that the dog be euthanized. Reporting live in Colleen, Jasmine Caldwell, Channel 6 News. All right, Jasmine, thank you very much.